the jingle of my dog's leash because he's visiting us. And then I got really happy when I sang that song because I was thinking about singing it to my dog. Is that weird? So sort of by association, you just told my dog that you're in love with him too because you sang it. There's something like dog love that's just so good. Who, who's it? Who, who's a cat person here? Who's a dog person? Cats are good, but a little salt and pepper. No, I like some cats. I had a bad experience with cats because they like to urinate on my belongings. Multiple cats, multiple times. This one will not go out to my dog, I promise. That seems like false um, inspiration for a singer-songwriter. What do you do on stage? Well, I think about my dog. <laughs> this song I wrote... Oh, God. In, like, the 80s, I feel like. The 1980s, you know that? How old is it? Like an embryo here? Sorry, go ahead. You are not born in 72. You're 17, so you were born when? Oh, God. 1980! 94? Oh, you were born after 1990? Oh. Well, anyway, I wrote the song when you were five. No, I wrote the song a while ago and I went through a period of. You know, when you eat one thing over and over again and then you're just like, I would never want to eat this ever again? Or when you're reasons, yeah. I know. Like, or when you're dating somebody and then one day you wake up, you look at them, you're like, oh. I know. about this song because oh, wow. I just was I was with it for too long and like, I didn't appreciate it but I kind of I think I went through a cycle where I all I was known for was this song oh, don't get all excited thinking you know what I'm going to play okay? <laughs> even though you do and I think there was something in me that's like I'm more than this song I'm dark and twisted and I'm interesting and I have more things to Say, but it just so happened that the one, this like little, little cute little song that I wrote is the one song that everybody knew, and so I was refused to play it. Who the hell do I think I am? But anyway, in recent years, I've come to understand that it has been the ambassador for many people to hear the rest of my music, and it's brought me probably here tonight. So I have a lot of I have a lot of love for it and a lot of appreciation for it, but I do have to change up the way that I sing it because otherwise I will hurt myself. So I decided to kind of just do a little stripped down kind of ukulele version. So this is a, this is that song for you today. <clears throat> if you were falling, then I would catch you. you 
you